Hey guys, uh, if you've recently watched my uh, CSGO uh, FPS fix tutorial, uh, I actually forgot to tell people how to permanently disable the FPS cap. And so I'll just quickly do that here. Um, first, depending on where you've got your CSGO installed, uh, by default it should be in Program Files x86 for 64-bit Windows, um, Steam Apps, Steam, Steam Apps, and you can see the address at the top here, and Common, Counter-Strike Global Offensive, CSGO, CFG, and this is where all your config files are saved, and by default, uh, Windows actually hides the extensions of the file types, and you need to uncheck this box that says hide extensions for known file types, because if you don't uncheck it, and you try to create the file, it'll actually save as a text file instead of a configuration file. Um, so it'll, it'll be like .cfg, .txt, but you won't be able to see the, the file extension. So uncheck that and then you pretty much want to go new file text document and save it as auto exec dot and because you can see the txt file extension you can change it straight away to dot cfg and I'll just delete that because I've already made the file and it should look like that once you've made it and then you go to file, uh, right click it and go to open with and if it doesn't come up by default just click show more and open it with notepad and enter fps underscore max zero and then save it and that should uh, unlock the fps in your game whenever you boot up global offensive you won't have to you won't have to use the console and enter it by yourself you can also put in other commands here i can't really think of any that are relevant to csgo because they took a lot of them out and and you know there's like consistency where you can't uh, set certain settings because the server has has its own settings that are set so yeah that's the main one and hopefully um yeah hopefully a lot of people benefit from this fix because with pascal cards and gpu boost it's it's just a shame that um nvidia don't take that into account that some people actually do want crazy amounts of fps for certain games uh for minimum frame latency okay thanks guys see ya